Welcome to Starbase Pink. This is your daily space and SpaceX news. We have possible closure for today, Friday, September 9th from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Maybe they will cancel it or we will see another spin prime test for Booster 7. But before that, yesterday at Starbase, we saw another Booster 7 spin prime test. We don't know how many engines, but it looks like it's more than six engines. Not so far from B7, we saw the first static fire test for Ship 24 with six Raptors, three sea level engines and three vacuum engines. Let's hear the sound. Looks like it was a successful one, but brush fire started in the area next to Ship 24 and the wind helped to spread it. It took nine and a half hours to put out the fire. We have some heat tires missing after six engine static fire tests for Ship 24. All thanks to La Padre for the amazing 24-7 live coverage. Zach Gordon said almost 30 damaged or missing tires on Ship 24 after six engine static fire test that lasted for eight seconds. Elon responded, he said, yep, there is a reason we do static fires much better to break things on the ground than en route to orbit. And we have this close-up picture from SpaceX the moment the engines were fired. NASA has selected Axiom Space to deliver a more working system, including advanced spacesuits for Artemis 3, the second crewed mission and the first attempt to land crew on the surface of the moon for the first time in over 50 years with a cost of $228.5 million. That's it for now. This is the end of this episode. See you tomorrow.